Nigerian mom jubilates for lockdown as her husband gives her a special treat. A Nigerian mother is currently thanking for the lockdown after she received a special treat from her husband. A video which went viral on different platforms showed the moment her son called her downstairs to the kitchen to see something. The unsuspecting mother rushed downstairs to a seemingly small but pleasant surprise. A hobby prepared delicious bowls of fruit salad for her. Obviously, she isn't used to such treats as a reaction says it all. This is sickness to the highest level. She's celebrating for the lockdown all because of the treats the husband is giving to her during this period of lockdown. You can see and you can imagine the kind of families that we do have today. You can imagine the kind of homes that we do have today. This is a Nigerian mother who is rejoicing, celebrating that we, we, are, we are experiencing lockdown in Nigeria just because of our own home. You see, this is what I'm talking about. We should be looking at this thing in two, in two, in two different ways. You see, one is we say that this family and this woman are selfish and self-centered. And two, this family, they are not, they don't want to be a family because the husband has, has made the family not to be called a family. How, how can you as a husband of a home, you have a wife and you have children and you will not be performing your daily responsibility as a husband to your wife. You cannot be showing love to your family. It's, 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 it's only you alone and just you. You are only after yourself. Anything concerning your family, you, 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 uh, it's, uh, uh, you, you, uh, you, you don't have any business about it. Are you a father? What kind of father are you? Are you, are you supposed to be a father at all? See what you turn your wife into. You turn your wife into a selfish being. See what you turn her into. Instead of her to be crying for, for the country, for locking everybody in door, instead she's celebrating because of you, because of the care that you've not been giving to her. Why, they, they, why, why, we don't, why they, they, there was no lockdown? But because the, the, the Nigeria has decided to lock everybody indoor, you now decide to show her the love that she has never in her entire life experienced. Are you not a wicked man? I want to say that, in fact, you are a, you are a cheat of a man. You decide to show your wife the love because the, 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 the room and the opportunity to go out there and cheat on her with other women has been equally locked, locked down. You have been locked down and the woman you are cheating with is equally locked down. So you both don't have the opportunity to see each other anymore. That is why you decided to transfer the love back to your wife. You can see what you turn your wife into. You turn your wife into a selfish being and also... A, and also uh, uh, a liar. Instead of her to be crying that this country has been unfair to the masses, instead, you, you made her to be celebrating when she's not supposed to celebrate. You made her to be celebrating when she's not supposed to celebrate. When she's supposed to be crying, she's celebrating. When she's supposed to be celebrating, she's crying. 
it's, it's, it's very, very abnormal. You turn your wife to an abnormal being. You are not a husband to say. So now, what if they not call off the, the lockdown now? The care will stop. The love will stop. The assistance you give to her will stop. All of those things will stop. The love will stop. Ah, this is this is a perfect Nigerian man. A perfect Nigerian man. This is the reason why Americans, American ladies are, are afraid of you people. I'm telling you, I used to say it, and I keep saying it, that our Nigerian men are very, very deceitful. Especially when it comes to marriage. When it comes to marriage, we are deceitful. We are, in, fact, in fact, I'm telling you the truth. Some of our Nigerian men are very, very deceitful. They are only after themselves. They don't care. care. They don't care about the family. They don't care about their wife or how the, um, how the children or, or, or the well-being of the children. The welfare of the children is none of their business. If the children have eaten, it's none of their business. They will tell you that it is the responsibility of the woman to take care of the children. Can you imagine? Who gave birth to the children? The children are given birth by both of you. You gave you you the man and the woman gave birth to these children. So you both own the children. So you both need to take care of these children. The support need to come between you both. You must not be biased. You must not. Um, you must not. Try to, to, to show any, uh, any hatred whatsoever. You understand? How can you as a father deny your wife the love that she truly deserve and truly deserve at the right time? Why did you marry her? Why? And you, the woman, you are celebrating. You are celebrating the lockdown that Nigeria government has locked everybody indoor because your husband is now using the opportunity to show you the love that he has not been showing you. Are you not sick? Are you not sick upstairs? You have a problem. You have a problem as a, as a mother. If your husband is not showing you any love, that is his problem. That is his problem. Let him be. Let him be. That is his problem. That is Nigerian man for you. A Nigerian man will always be like a Nigerian man. That is the attitude. It takes the grace of God for you to get a very good Nigerian man that will, that will be of good support to the wife. I'm telling you, I'm a Nigerian and I'm just telling the reality. Sometimes I keep asking myself, why am I in, why am I in Nigeria? Yeah. Why am I in Nigeria? And I keep praying to God, please God, help me so that I will not behave like a Nigeria. You can imagine. So we really need to help ourselves. We really need to support ourselves. So madam, I plead to you, please, let's your own problem be your own problem. Don't allow your problem to go to the other people. You understand? Don't see your husband should be should should uh, should be called to order. Call your husband to order and talk to him. Let him know. Try to know the reason why he has not been performing his duty. Do you understand? Because this attitude you just portrayed now is very, very abnormal. And I know many Nigerians will never and will never be happy with you. 99% Nigerians are totally against this lockdown. Just you alone is in support of it. Just because of love and special treats. What betide the treats? So, my viewers, 
you can see what we are experiencing in this country. We are, you can see what we, we, we see in this country. Don't forget your comments are of very much importance. Don't forget to leave them behind.